Okay, so then go, 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 Good morning everybody, welcome to a new video. And we're going to eat Bayat. It's gonna be one heck of a ride, three to five hours in the ocean, in a boat with no seats. Mm. So we have to sleep uh, maybe or lay down in the boat and it's gonna be wavy. It's a bigger boat by the way. Yeah, it's quite big actually, so that's gonna be nice. And when we uh, dock in it by that island, there's no port or pier. We actually have to jump off the boat onto land. Really cool. If you go in the port, you need to jump. Oh my god. <laughs> but uh, it, the water is very calm, so. Uh, it really looks, good. Yeah, yeah, it looks great today, guys. The ocean is very calm. But Itpayat Island, this is as far as north as you can go. There's only one island you can go further, but you need to go with the army. Look at all the cargo going onto the ship. It's quite a lot. Beautiful sunrise in the background. That's my favorite color, the clouds. Excited for it, yet? Actually, yes, like super, super yes. But I'm not ready for the waves. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but the waves are not so big today. I hope so. It is what Sunday or Saturday? Saturday. Saturday. That's probably why there's so many people here. Packed up, cramped up, like sardines. But hopefully, we'll find a spot on the floor where we can just sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, we're boarding the uh, boat right now and this should be one heck of an interesting ride. Thank you sir. We got some pretty nice seats. I think we're able to uh, lay down and rest majority of the time, hopefully. Dock over there, guys. In a road. Oh, oh. Catching some fish. This island is absolutely stunning, guys. The cliff race is massive. Look at that. How was your sleep? Yeah, you know how short that was? What? That was one and a half hour and supposedly it takes three to five hours depending on the waves. Actually, we have 30 minutes more. Yeah, still two hours. That's super quick. The ocean is very flat compared to what we've been hearing about. That is going to be rough waves all the way. Oh. Rough waves all the way, but it's not. And the guys behind us, they have a bunch of fishing lines in the water now, so hopefully they're gonna get some fish. Really? That'd be cool to see. There's a spectacular cliff range also.
colors on it. Welcome to it by us. That's a good window. Yeah, it's a nice ducking. Ooh, so beautiful. Alright, we're looking for who? What's his name? Juju Labrador. Huh? Juju Labrador. What a fun trip that was. Do you know the fish they caught? Goldfish. Goldfish. That's what they said. <laughs> that was way smoother than normal. Yeah. Or what everybody told us. Alright, Rooster. Oh, it's a big one. Is you gonna throw it? Yeah. <laughs> There's a motorbike, a festival. Alright, so what's on the agenda? I think we're just going to a town. I don't even know the name of it. So steep! <laughs> it's very steep, guys. But it's so green here. Wow. Oh. Come on, it's not that steep. It's actually really steep. Wow, guys, this island is crazy. Very similar to Batan, except uh, there's a little bit more tropical here. The trees and the bushes. All right, I guess we're gonna stay here. Welcome to the town of Bayan. Here's a room, guys. Not too bad, nice, nice, clean. Old school bed, I like it. I like the decoration. I don't know, I always like old things. What about you, Shirley? Do you like old things? Yes. You know what the best thing about this room is? The table. Yes. We can edit on a table. We've been editing in the bed the last two weeks. Yes. Always in the bed with my mouse, editing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now we have a good table. We're grabbing a quick late breakfast. We got, what is this, red rice? Yep. Look at this That's rice. That's a local rice, by the way. It almost looks like it's a little bit purple, but it's called red rice. Then, my favorite... Pepsi, look. Beef butto, pork. Ah, it's just pork. It's a pork. Pork for sure. <laughs> that is sweet. Pork silog. We finished the uh, early lunch and now we're off to the bike. And we're gonna explore Itpayet Island. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay, I'll be behind. While Sherlyn is getting the environmental fee here on the side of the road, we got garlic. And our tour guide, he said two of the main incomes or production of this island is garlic. You know what surprises me? What? They're, they're drying the onion right. I've never seen that before. I thought it was only with rice. How long do they, do they dry it? One week. Wow. That's quite long. Welcome to the view deck. Look at this. I actually have those uh, lines tattooed on my body here on my right side. Finn and I was planning to go there, but unfortunately, Kuya said that the Yami Island is not part of the Philippines anymore. What? <laughs> the, farthest, the farthest island there, in, which belongs to the Philippines, is uh, Mavulis. Mavulis. Not, uh, Mavulis is the last one. Yes. <laughs> oh, guys, we were actually thinking about to go there, but it's a bit expensive, so we're not sure. Kuya said this is the last frontier of Batanes. Yeah. Is that amazing? We've been I, to the I Palawan know, right? for the last frontier of Palawan, which is Balabak, and now we're here for the last frontier it's of Palawan. It's amazing, Palawans. right? It's insanely <laughs> beautiful, right? We've been to the edge of the world. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> These islands behind us are the furthest point in the whole country of the Philippines. You can't go any further than that. Oh, it's gonna be time. Oh, time Unless went. you go to another country. <laughs> are you kidding me? What? Now that is a oh, blue color. My that God. is crazy. If only I had listened for a while, I would have told you I miss your smile. I thought of you as a friend who can't let go. I can feel it grow 
casually putting down the drone after a spectacular fly seeing the locals catch a fish and octopus i believe it was i wasn't quite sure and Don't then of course the kids playing around and the fishermen either paddling or with the motor and showing the fish and <laughs> showing the fish that was a great shot what a local life here in the island let's go down check out the blue lagoon hello kuya you catch octopus oh wow that is octopus how deep did you have to go, Koya? Just about 13. Only 13 meters? It's massive. Look it's at that. It's so big. It's huge. Look at the size. <laughs> oh my. Oh, it's many. It's three. It's three. I see. Okay. I thought it was one big one. We're gonna go down here guys, check it out a little bit. Ooh. Hey. Once you get a good grip with your hands, then you go down. Careful now. Yep. Whoa. Whoa. And this could be a very dangerous cave to swim through if there's a lot of current pulling you back and forth. Another lagoon. Yay. <laughs> it's more like a swimming pool. Wow. Ocean swimming pool. <laughs> it's a it's a nature made. Yep. I like it. It's really cool. If the waves are coming in. Whoa! We gotta be careful over here. Oh but it's like a perfectly shaped pool. Gives you a small barrier so you don't go out unless there's like a huge wave. All right, let's give this uh, swimming pool a try. Nice one. Oh yeah. Are you here? Ah! <laughs> oh! Oh! Okay. It's getting quite big. We almost got dragged out earlier. Let's go. And I even got a cut from it, guys. Anyways, let's go, go, go. Pick up some plastic. Bring it out, bottle. Good job. Good job. Okay, Zelly, go, 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 We made her back up. We're gonna go check out the last spot, the cave. The cave? I don't know. I haven't even seen it in a picture, but we'll go check it out. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> you seem like starstruck. I am. I am. Yeah. Like, this is crazy. It's so beautiful. I've literally seen nothing like this before. 